Fast doesn't mean your screens do not have to look nice. With our systems, there are screen templates available that can help you with that. Let's see how. So here, we are looking at my service studio where I have a reactive web application. I haven't done much beyond it. Basically what I plan to do is create a product catalog using the information I have available in this Excel sheet. The name, the category, the picture and description. Uh, I'll quickly go ahead and import this Excel sheet into my application by dragging and drop it over the data tab. Uh, what the platform does, it imports the Excel sheet and creates these entities and the attributes. Uh, what I can do uh, quickly is create a screen so anybody who is familiar with our systems can you know understand this part where you can drag and drop an entity and what the platform does is creates the listing and detail screen uh, to be honest these uh, the UX UI is not so bad uh, you can see here uh, the listing screen where some of the details of product has been captured like the uh, name picture category description exactly what it was in Excel sheet I can go ahead and modify these things if I don't need. For example, I can get rid of this column, picture doesn't make sense. I can use uh, some sort of uh, like CSS, visual CSS here to make it nicer. And beyond that, I can also have access to all of these uh, visual widgets that I can use to uh, make my screen more interesting. Okay, now there's even a better way of doing this. I create nice looking screens by using screen templates. Let's see how. So just to go back, what we have now is product listing and detail screen. What we're going to do is use the screen templates. So this is how you use it. Drag and drop the screen element. And you have access to then all these screen templates which are available. First and foremost, there are different categories of these. These are the common uh, use cases that a developer will come across like dashboards, details, forms, galleries, and so on and so forth. Uh, what is interesting about screen templates is these uh, templates are fully functional so behind the scenes the ui the query the logic everything is there for a developer to look at now if you're curious you can also go ahead and explore this link uh, platform you know in our systems you can even create your own screen templates and pass it on to your developers in my case uh, to uh, create a nice looking product catalog i think this is the one that would be nicer so perhaps this could be my home page home page and I can create it. So behind the scenes, uh, the platform creates the screen, which is here now. You can see the layout that I have now. Uh, basically, this is what I'm after. And if I expand the home page here, I can see that it's all very nicely created with some local variables, with some queries here and there, and some you know logic, additional logic to uh, maintain the page. Now, once I'm satisfied, once I've understood what is there, or you know I have a basic understanding of what is going on. I can go ahead and replace this sample data with my product table. Okay, something like uh, with a drag and drop. Poof, it's done. Now, depending on how the uh, data models are between the sample data and your table, there would be f a few more steps, few more tweaking that might be required. But basically, in the end, we are after the layout, we are after these functionalities which screen templates give you. So, in my case, for example, as you had seen, I have a picture, a product picture. So I can perhaps use the image, put it here. Image is in database, so it's coming as a URL and it's stored in this field, okay? And I think it looks okay. Beyond that, what I can also do is uh, make any of these elements like uh, the, the products here. When somebody clicks on them, it may take them to the product detail page. So for that, what I'll do is maybe select one element, link it to the details page. Okay, and the ID that will pass is the current one. And I think looks okay. What I will do is also make this home page my new default landing page so that we don't have to go to the product, uh, the other page that was created by scaffolding. And in the end, just go ahead and publish it. So uh, just to read, read screen templates are uh, a, a, a better way of creating nice looking screens. For developers, uh, they do not have to just use scaffolding to create forms and uh, you know listing screens with platform screen templates can give you a better way of creating these so you can see now i think the bootstrap is running so go ahead and refresh it okay now the job has run you can see how the data is being shown now in the form of a gallery where the pictures the properties 
and a lot of the cool features that we got why the screen templates are available for example if i search everything is working because behind the scenes we just took over the uh, the, the sample data and the sample functionality in the screen template with our product table right so all of these things are working and in the end we also linked it up with the gale page so this becomes nice and easy very well connected okay that's all thanks for watching